always best to shop local whenever possible. And now MasterCard is giving shoppers some extra incentives to shop close to home. They're offering a $200 gift card to participating businesses. They'll be allowed to give away to lucky customers. It's all called Homegrown Holidays Campaign. And joining us now is Greg Lawson with the New Orleans Business Alliance to tell us more about it. And this is the latest campaign to shop local. Greg, tell us more about it. Thank you. Good morning. Thank you for having us, Sheba. Um, as you know, COVID-19 uh, had devastating impacts on our local economy. Uh, so to address this kind of economic fallout for COVID, uh, the New Orleans Business Alliance partnered with the City of New Orleans to really launch the Resilient Corridor Initiative that focuses across seven neighborhoods who've seen disinvestment over the last kind of 20 years. Uh, those neighborhoods include Bittertown, Holly Grove, Treme, New Orleans, East and Algiers. And so we're excited to partner with MasterCard this holiday season to really re-engage and reignite uh, our residents to really shop local uh, in their neighborhoods. So yeah. We're offering an incentive to local shoppers of $200 to just shop uh, at 50 participating businesses throughout our seven neighborhoods. That's really cool. And so you mentioned disinvestment. Kind of break down what that means for folks. And so over the last... Uh, 50 years or since Katrina, I should say, um, several neighborhoods haven't recovered as much uh, of the commercial corridors, particularly in the Wall of East, Algiers, as you uh, mentioned, uh, Gertown, Holly Grove, and particularly the Lower Ninth Ward. And so we really focus on the VA efforts and resources in those seven neighborhoods um, to really make sure that they have an extra support and extra love, particularly the small businesses um, within those commercial corridors. Sure. And it has an amazing effect on the entire local economy. Kind of explain that for people, because I think people think it's simple to go on Amazon, which is great. You click a button, don't have to leave your house. But there are benefits to our entire city and community when you spend your dollars locally. Yeah, small businesses of the life grid are the, uh, for our economy here in New Orleans. And so when you shop local, that dollar stays in your community. Um, as we also know, small businesses within these communities are also employ communities and sustain these communities over time. And so uh, really shopping locally really double down with your dollar um, and really supports uh, local owned businesses. Yeah, and you have some great options there. You're showing Queendom Aesthetics. I've done a story on Melissa Odoms with her spa empire out in New Orleans East, which is absolutely amazing. And that's the great thing. You're supporting locals and their dreams who are providing things for our community. Yeah, and so we have a list of 50 participating businesses that you can find at www.nobleba.org. Um, and we have everything ready from restaurants such as, you know, the Chases, or the coffee houses, or back of town, uh, Baldwin New Bookstore. So it's really, really trying to incentivize our local residents as well as visitors to really uh, shop locally and visit these kind of homegrown uh, businesses. Sure. I also think this is great because if you have people on your list you've been buying for for years, to go online and find something, you're kind of getting them the same thing over and over. If you give them a local experience yeah. like a restaurant gift card or a spa experience they've never been to, you're keeping it local, but you're also diversifying your gift list. Yes, you really are. And you're really supporting some great entrepreneurs who have really, uh, you know, COVID really decimated our economy. So really kind of double down to spend your dollars even more. Sure. So putting your own neighborhood. Yeah, and so much spending happens during this holiday season. I would imagine this can shift businesses to a greater position as we enter the new year. Yeah, and so our goal is with this holiday campaign is to really not just uh, spike uh, spur sales for the holiday campaign, but to really look at how do we spur into the upcoming uh, Mardi Gras festival seasons. Yeah. So how do we kind of get the ball rolling for small business owners? All right. Well, as you said, there's 50 businesses that are participating. And so one customer will get a chance at each of those locations to win a $200 gift card? Yeah. And so, yeah, everything. And so once you, uh, while you're shopping, uh, fill out our raffle card and drop it in the box. And then uh, midway through the campaign, you'll get a call if you're the winner uh, and you get a $200 gift card. So it's another way to incentivize residents to really spend money as well. Because as you're spending money, you have a chance to actually win $200. Well, I'm feeling lucky, Greg, so I'm going to head out to go shopping. Thanks so much for joining us this morning to tell us all about the campaign. All right. Thank you for having me. All right. The New Orleans Business Alliance Partnership with MasterCard supports small businesses, again, in neighborhoods like Algiers, New Orleans East, Gentilly, Town, Holly Grove, the Lower Ninth Ward, and Treme. These neighborhoods are part of the New Orleans Business Alliance Resilient Corridors Initiative to help these businesses and the communities grow and thrive and make them attractive to investors. So MasterCard will, again, be offering that $200 gift card to a lucky person shopping in the store. Let's get over to April.